What's up, fans? It's me, Snickers Fox TV. Today it's a bus, a bus talk part three. It isn't really like the bus talk part three. Technically not in the bus talk. So basically, the bus. So as you may see right now, I'm in the bathroom, and right now. That doesn't count as a bus talk just because I'm not in the bus. So, you guys, make sure to sub subscribe, leave a like, and comment down below. So, let's start the video. So, basically, what it starts is that, um, oh, there's one story about there's one boy. In our school, they don't allow us to go to the forest anymore. Well, just because. There's one boy ruining it for all. And here's my cat over here. He's right now in the tree. He get left that hole, but never mind. So, as am I saying, there's one boy that ran away. And there's my classmates just chased him. And the policeman that is guarding our school was chasing that boy too. And then, basically, right, almost, he almost get lost, but they successfully found him. Since that day, they didn't allow us to go near the forest. Because they didn't want to prevent those, prevent us, uh, I don't know what to say, prevent us by going into the forest. So... If you watch my short one, the, my newest shorts, which I talked about Tart, when I mentioned previously on my very first video, what the heck is he's doing? What the heck is he doing? Ow. He's just a cat. In the tree. See it? So, never mind. That was the first story. So, basically, there's another story I want to tell you. Tark just succeeded from the team. If you're one of my new subscribers and you don't know what I'm talking, just check out the very, my very first video where I talked about it. That my friend Tark is leaving. And he left. And I also mentioned him in this one shorts video. That's pretty sad. So, basically, as we see, <sighs> that doesn't clearly count as a bus talk just because I'm not in a bus. But let's count it as that. There's a, like another stories, but before I'm gonna tell you, I want to tell you this one story. So I remember one time, it was summer. That was bef way, way, way before I was I created my very first channel. No, I meant I meant the channel that you're watching right now. Even before the video that I created, my very first one, it was summer. When I went outside, my friend, Glab, as I mentioned about him in a couple of my videos. So basically, there's one, like his grandma is like looking for him. And there's a couple of his friends, Matthew's friends, which is Glab's little brother, were finding him. And I asked them, what is going on? And they said to me, oh, Glab went missing. And she thought that I was with Glab. Well, because we're best friends. And since he's right now, he's 13 at that time. And right now he's 14. So I kind of worried for him too. I was looking for him everywhere. 
And then he went out peacefully and calmly and I asked him where you've been. And there's like, have you seen this couple of my videos like next to this wall or this wooden wall? Yeah, the next side there's like pure garbage. There's garbage, stuff like that. But I'll probably make, make a video about it in the future when it's sunshine. I'll probably make that video where I'm going to explore that area. I'm going to show that for you in the future. But that future is kind of long away. So, and I decided to went there because I've never been there before. And it shocked me. He told me that there are rats everywhere trash and growing plants and there's another story story kind of related to it one time when me and my mom were like going to like this one place try to bury like an expired bread onto the ground because it expires there much faster than in the garbage can so there's one guy came up to us with a bicycle. He said, "What are you doing here, guys?" And we and we lied to him and said to him, "Oh, we're just planting something. We're not planting something." What? Well, I, I don't really remember what she lied about, but I do remember crystal clear that it was a lie. Then he said, "Okay." Then he went to the place. As you remember, where my f best friend went, this is where criminals hang. Love to hang out there a lot. And there used to be a hole, but they cover it right now, and it's now blocked. We'll probably get in there, and and we're going to explore there in the future. But that future is kind of far away. So as I previously said, there are criminals everywhere. I don't know what to say about this. But there's one time with my friends where I kind of play hide and seek. There's my sister's friends and Matthew's friends. We basically play with them, including my friend Hide and Seek. So basically, he's the counter. And then he, while he counted, he tried to find something. Like while he was counted, we went to that one mysterious forest. He said they learned a lot about that forest. Forest. We kind of, we barely go to that forest. Well, because it's a forest, what's to do in there? And plus there's criminals living there. They said that their parents don't really care about it. Well, just because, I don't know what to say, but they don't really care about their kids. Which is my sister's friends and Matthew's friends. So, as you may see right now, or as you might think right now, why they're hiding there? There's a lot of criminals. Well, they said that they pretty much allow to go there. You might be asking why. Well, just because they, I don't know what to say, they don't really care about them. They just let them go wherever they go. And they don't watch them. They don't watch about criminal movies a lot. My mom does love criminal movies. And that's why she's worried always to leave us alone. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey. What are you doing? What are you doing? Ow. Ow. What are you doing? That carpet is not for you. 
and actually about my cat. He's becoming aggressive. Well, I think the video is over. So make sure to subscribe, leave a like, comment down below, and that's it. Video is over. Peace out.